after four years, and this is one of the interesting things actually, after four years I did £12,000 a year. And I think a lot of people come up to me now and they say, I started, I started my own business a couple of years ago, or three years ago, or four or five years ago, and it's just not doing very well. I'm only doing, you know, 100,000 or whatever they think of as not being, not being very good. And it's, um, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter how big your business is. It's about learning what makes a business work in the early years. So I did four years, 12,000 pounds a year. And in 1990, I doubled my workforce. Now, a lot of people now think, you know, if they haven't got 100 people in four years, they're not doing very well. It literally took me four years to go from one to two people. And then it took me another four years, as you can see here. In 1994, I went bust, <coughs> which was a real shock to the system. Really annoying. And it was a sort of, um, it was an interesting one, because I went bust. I went bust because I lost focus. And I think if you have your own business, it's really important to decide, I'll talk about a little bit about this later, but decide what you're going to do and just stick with it. What I did in 1994, a little shirt business, doing two and a half million pounds a year by then, so we have grown quite a lot in, 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 uh, after the first four years, two and a half million pounds, making 250,000 pounds a year profit, great little business. And basically what happened is I got a bit, I got a bit bored. And this is one of the dangers with keeping focus, keeping focus, I got a bit bored. So we were very good mail order shirt company. And uh, what I did is I bought a little chain of children's clothes, children's clothes shops, five children's clothes shops. Now what the hell I was thinking, I really don't know. You know, I was good at selling men's shirt by mail order. I wasn't good at retail and I didn't know anything about children's clothes. And I found out very quickly that men, my customers, didn't want to buy children's clothes. And I lost more money in three months than I made in the last three years and the business went bust. And I remember, I think by that stage we had about six or eight people, you know, eight years in, six or eight people, pretty small business. And I remember, it was a bit pathetic actually, a bit weedy, but I took everyone off to the pub. It was in the days when pubs were open at sort of 10 o'clock in the morning, which is when the receiver came in. And I just burst into floods of tears. 